All right, everybody, welcome back to another video. We are playing some AP Kogma in the mid lane. We have Comet, Manaflow, Transcendence, Scorch, Cheap Shot, and Ultimate Hunter. Against a Twisted Fate. Not too scared of him, but I'm scared of Hecarim. So, AP Kogma pretty much consists of you just spitting on them with your E early game. This is a pick that really scales, like, over time. Like, super late game, it gets strong. You hit a power spike at level 11 and level 16. But my build path, I think I'm going to go Ludens into uh, Rylai's. But we'll see. He has Phase Rush. And he has a ton of potions. So we'll only focus on poking him for the... Uh, the mana flow stack. You can also go uh, Presence of Mind second tree with uh, probably Coup de Grasse. But I don't want to scale that long this game. I want to try and do damage through mid game. Because you never know how long the games are going to last. If you're trying to play for like a 30 minute game, it's not always going to happen. So I'm thinking Cheap Shot will give me some damage mid-game. And if I get a Rylize, it's going to always proc. I actually traded him very well there. Huh. It's a horsey. Alright, buddy. Oh, did you forget I have Barrier Friend? Goodbye. I'm surprised he didn't ignite me. I mean, I have red buff, but TF can flash gold card me and kill me. So we'll just stay back. I think in like 10 more seconds I'll have enough health to survive it. Oh, Shaco killed him, so I got an assist. If he could help me push, that'd be awesome. Okay, I guess we gotta do it. Uh, TF's probably gonna teleport back to the cannon minion and freeze the wave. Darn. Wait, I gotta eat. Holy shit, that move speed. I thought I was gonna go one for one with Hecarim there because of his ignite. That ended up really well for us. I don't think I need a potion. I got red buff. Uh, if she has parry up, Renekton loses this. Yeah, he doesn't do enough damage, sadly. He might make it out. Ah, he has Grasp. He doesn't have the right rune. Wait, I have Red Buff. I'm just gonna auto him. I don't care if I get hit. Oh, I canceled an auto. I could've had him. Darn. Darn my low attack speed and my terrible auto attacking skills. I should've flashed earlier, too. I committed way too late. I should have just waited till level 6, too. Well. Oh, this guy's back. You know what? We're gonna fight him. I don't care. Holy shit. I don't remember AP Kogma doing this much damage. But uh, your alt does more damage the lower health they are. If they're below 40%, they take a... It pretty much crits. 
Your bot lane's missing. I mean, it's just a Maokai and Lucian. I should be okay. Unless Maokai flashes on me. But let's go recall really quick. We can get a uh, Blasting Wand. So Cheap Shot's working. It's done 100 damage so far. Is that card going to follow me? Oh, I didn't get it off. I don't know if uh, how Ultimate Hunter works with his ult, but I'm assuming it lowers a cooldown. I don't see why it wouldn't. But with something like Cor with Corky ult, it doesn't really lower the cooldown of his ult for some reason. But I think Kog'Maw ult's different. But the more you use the ult, it uh, doubles the mana cost every time. Or uh, increases it by 40, I think. So you don't want to spam it too much in a row. Unless you have a ton of mana. But the thing is, if you go to the mana build, you lose a lot of damage early. A little bit off with the E. No tier. No, I'm going a little more uh, mid build this game. That's why I didn't go Presence of Mind or tier. I'm trying to be strong before the game is over. Because if you you play the tier build with presence of mind, you're playing for 30 minutes. Oh, my E didn't go off. I don't think that'll kill him. Even if it did hit. Maybe, who knows. How much damage does that do? 250? I think he had more than 250 health, but I'm not 100%. Okay, Lost Chapter is giving me mana to stay in lane, but I don't know where Hecarim is. I'm probably going to get ganked. If I could hit him with the slow, I can kill him. There we go. He's not happy. Oh, we got more mana because of the level up. That's why I love Lost Chapter. It's such a good item. Oh my god, dude. This, this damage. I'm level 9. Uh-oh. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, shit. He angry. See, I have red buff and barrier, so I might win this. I don't know. Okay, there's, there's so mad. Now who's teleporting? They're fucking fuming. Oh, fuck. I think I'm dead here, boys. This lowers her armor, maybe? <gasps> I'm alive. What the fuck? I'm leaving. I'm pulling out. No more gambling with my life. Although, we don't, now we have the Ludens. Okay, let's do Boots and Dark Seal. Dark Seal will give us a little bit more mana in our pool. I mean, I guess I could just pick up a tier and only a tier and not try and upgrade it. That wouldn't be too bad. We're not really having mana issues yet. We're, we haven't even hit the point of the game where we spam our ult. Level 11, and once we get a Rylai's next, we'll spam the shit out of our ult and just run people down. I feel like I've had permanent red buff too in this lane. But yeah, it's looking like this is uh, going to be a tuber, so if you guys liked the video, it helped me out a ton. And also, check if you're subscribed. I want to get ganked. I do have flash, but uh, Ekram's going to have alt this time. You know he won't come from the bottom side. The E hit him, but not the alt. Okay, he is coming from the top side. 
Dude, that is the squishiest Hecarim I've ever seen, because he went the AD item. Oh, that burst. Almost level 11. I don't even know if we need the Rylize against them. We're just landing the slow. The E slow is all we need. Okay, so I'm four levels on this guy. So if I just stand still and fight him, I should just win. Way he's healing. Oh, this guy's gonna have TP move speed. He has no flash though. I'm pretty sure he used it. Jesus, bro. Let's go this way. See you later. See you later. I'm alive. Okay. Come on. Dive me. Dive me. I fucking dare you. I fucking dare you. Oh shit. Okay, I thought that was gonna hit me. It's all right. I'd rather lose barrier than my flash. What am I buying here? I mean, I could just go right into the Leandres. Or... We could go right into a death cap and do even more damage. It's... I'm gonna do what I said in the beginning, though. I'm just gonna go the Rylize. That sounds fun. The slow on the alt is really fun for chasing people down. Oh, this guy's so dead. Renekton! You had one job! <laughs> what is this, a Meow Kai? Why do I just delete them all? Holy cow. You do not want to feed AP Kogma early. It's very hard to do that, but I mean... Once he gets rolling, he gets rolling. Yeah, he's missing because he's dead. Somebody else is mid. Oh, here he is. Okay, we got chill with the alt C's, 120 mana. Okay, never mind, I want to use more. <laughs> I always think it's not going to kill them, but then they're under 40% and it just crits and does so much damage. We try and bully Lucian under his turret. He might just try and kill me. My bully needs to walk up so they don't kill me right here. You guys have fun with the teleport. The Hecarim's diamond. That's surprising. He seems like the lowest rank on their team. Mm, since the game looks like it's going to be over soon, I'm just going to grab a blue potion. So now we do double true damage with Cheap Shot and the uh, Sorcery Potion. And now our ult just shreds.
I mean, they see me walking down. It's gonna be a little difficult to take them all on. I have to kite them. But good thing I have range. I'm gonna go with that plant. I'm gonna go grab blue buff. Actually just nuked him there. Where are you? I know you got slowed. Cogmar. Oh my god. <laughs> That's why we get the Rylize. I was able to keep hitting consecutive alts on him and run him down. Oh, we go Leandre's next with the Rylize slow. Burns more of their health. Go runes. Here you go. Bottom left. Let me just buy this item and I'll put it back up. Yeah, more like Pogma. That reaches so far. The level 16 alt reaches even further. But it's so hard to reach level 16 on Kogma. What are we doing with this red? She dashed into it. Got her. I'm out of... I got one alt shot left. I had him. I have no mana. Let's see if their blues up. Oh no. It ain't up anyway. Sorry, Morg. It looks like they want you. That that actually doesn't help you. Maybe I should have stayed. I didn't have enough for a uh, item. Well, let's just get Magi. It gives us move speed better for chasing these targets down. It gives us a little more mana, I think. I think only 50 more, but... They FF'd anyway, guys. So if you enjoyed the Kogma video, make sure to leave a like. And make sure to subscribe if you haven't. It helps me out a ton. And let's check out the damage. If it'll pop up. We did 23k damage. Here's the rune stats. I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video. Have a great day. Thank you for watching.